Greetings, this is Father Michael with our Word of the Week. This week's word is Assumption. Today we celebrate the Feast of the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. And if you visit the Pope's Cathedral, which is not St. Peter's, but rather the St. John Lateran Church in Rome, and you go down the main aisle and take a left, the beautiful side altar, you see an image of Our Lady assumed body and soul into heaven. And what's unique about this particular painting is that one of the prominent people in the image is not the Blessed Virgin Mary herself, but Saint Dominic. Dominic is envisioned a little bit anachronistically as being present in that moment that Mary is assumed into heaven. And so for Dominicans, there is a connection between the assumption of Mary and the ministry of the order of preachers. And it goes back to this very famous and fundamental story in the life of the order. St. Dominic had in 1216 just got the official stamp of approval to start an order of preachers, not an order of St. Dominic, not an order devoted to particular patronage of a saint, but as Dominicans, we are named by what we do, preach. And so the Pope said, go forth with the ministry of preaching the gospel. Dominic then thought, prayed, reflected, and that ministry which had been locally in southern France up until that point became for him the launching point to send the original Dominicans around the world. And so by August of 1217, he had decided to send the original 16 brothers to all the big university towns of the known world. Now this was met with a little bit of skepticism. The brothers said, we're probably better off staying together, building perhaps a priory or a large house from which we can minister. St. Dominic's reflection and his words became indeed foundational for our order. He said, seed that is stored rots but if it is scattered abroad, it can bear fruit and thrive. And so on Tuesday, August 15, 1217, in a little meadow in Pruy, France, 16 brothers placed their hands into the hands of St. Dominic, and he sent them forth to preach to places like Cologne, Bologna, England, in France, Toulouse, and Paris to preach the gospel to the world. This local movement of preaching, which began in southern France on that Assumption feast day, became the international order that it is today. It is, if you will, the Pentecost of St. Dominic on this feast of the Assumption. And so too for us here at St. Dominic's, on this Assumption day, St. Dominic says to us, that it's not enough for us simply to gather in the church, as needful as that is, but we come to the church, we worship together every day in order that we might be sent out to be that seed which is scattered. And our Blessed Virgin Mary, who is assumed into heaven, will be our protector, will be our guide, will be our inspiration in conveying and radiating and proclaiming the message of Jesus Christ. As we celebrate this Feast of Assumption, hear those words of St. Dominic afresh. Let my words indeed be those words of great commissioning to go forth, to preach wherever the Lord takes you, in your homes, at work, amongst family and friends. Share the gospel, be the gospel, radiate the gospel that you might assume indeed the care and the protection of our Blessed Mother and be the joy of the gospel in the heart of the city. Amen. Amen.